Hey guys, this is Production Music Live and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a pretty basic bass sound for Deep House productions or also for techno and electronic music productions. It's a long bass and it has a lot of power inside and it's very easy to make, for example, with Serum. So let's check out how it sounds if we filter it up. So it's this warm and long thing you want to put in there in the back if you're not looking for a rhythmic bass or if you just want this bass layer in there. Let's make this patch from scratch, init preset and start from the beginning. So we can actually already take this default wave in oscillator A. Let's quickly listen to how that one sounds. We definitely need a filter on top of that and I'm going to select this one, MG Low 12 over here and we need to be sure oscillator A is routed into the filter. And we take the filter down just a bit over here. And let's also take down the resonance. And that will do for now. Now we need to put up a bit of unison over here. So let's go to unison. We only have one voice playing. Let's play four. And let's detune them a bit together over here. And with this blend knob we can also decide how loud all of them are going to be adjusted. And you can see we can play the mid two louder than the uh, outside two, but we can also even it out a bit more. So let's even it out and listen in. That's already closer to what we're looking for. We can add drive over here with the filter. And this clicking is just our sidechain, so I'm taking that off for a minute and also taking off this pass filter here. Okay, so let's put in a sub bass as well. Click on sub over here, we select the sine wave, we are happy with that already and we are taking it down one octave. I'm quickly deselecting the first oscillator so we can hear the sub bass. Notice you really need a subwoofer or headphones to, to feel and listen this sub bass over here. And since we are clipping down here, I'm taking down the volume a bit. Okay. The next oscillator, this one, is also being used and we need analog, analog sin. So we need a sine wave over here. Let's listen to it on solo again. Drag up the volume a bit and unison up to four as well. And we are blending it down a bit over here as well. This is exactly what we're looking for. We can also put up the attack of the first envelope just a bit to get rid of this clicking. So there we go, this is our basic bass sound. You can go on and do a lot more stuff with effects now, but this is the basic thing. A lot of times it's exactly what I'm looking for to start my track and then get going from there, but I just need this basic layer in the back of my track and I can go on with other elements. So let's play together with everything else. Already 
works nicely in this track over here, in this first part of the template, and I think it's a very, very useful sound. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Check the description for more of our Serum and Massive presets. We also have this sound in Massive available. And if you like this template, there's also a link to it in the description. Subscribe to our channel, and I hope to see you next time.